everyone Jeans here today we're gonna talk about Roland event the new event okay this is the second day already um, but first of all I hope that everyone is healthy and please stay safe from COVID okay let's get back into the game okay this is the reward you can you can see and the palace will be open at 8 p.m. of the server time okay uh, what you need to do is if you able to secure and occupy the palace like we did yesterday for 1291 seconds there will be a reward tier reward okay make sure you claim all the reward okay there will be a claim button right next to it okay Make sure you claim it or else it will be gone. Okay. So what is Luolan event? First of all, when you go in, you need to place five minister as attacker. Of course you're gonna choose your strongest, your top five minister as your attacker. There's no point you choose a low CP to to be attacker, right? Everyone start off with 40 stamina and you gain 4 stamina each 30 minutes. Okay, at the base you can see here claim clock coins. Always claim this. You need this to buy uh, stuff in the shop from the shop. Okay, this is the healing pills that I bought yesterday. Anima uh, grass, I'm gonna show you just in a moment. Okay. Like this one, this is the anima grass, which is very helpful if your minister is defeated and then you <coughs> you have to wait for 5 minutes. But with anima grass, you can instantly uh, restore them. Okay. And I'm gonna buy this. This is a attack buff may decrease enemy HP by 25 to 100% for attackers only unstoppable momentum 20% chance to increase attack by 10 times okay for attackers only this is also the attacking buff annihilation 100% chance to increase attack by 2 times as for this one, you can use it on attacker or defender. If a minister HP is below zero, it will restore thirty percent. And this is a shield it is indestructibility. And Ima grass, uh, you can buy with gold too. Okay, but of course we're gonna use the cloud coin to purchase. And this is the super healing potion restore health by 30 percent 10 percent this is all the healing okay this is the stamina pack okay each bag uh gives you four stamina extra four stamina you can buy up to six okay so what is the strategy here First, uh, we have base, and then we have uh, wasteland. All this land is wasteland, and we have fort. This is fort, and also we have altar. Okay, to occupy it, you need prestige. Okay, so now I start with zero prestige. It will be uh, it will be refreshed to zero prestige every day. Okay, so what we need to do is uh, you either can RC for prestige or you can just uh, use stamina and make your way up to gain prestige. See, I don't have enough prestige, I, I can't uh, occupy it or, or, or conquer it. So what I need to do is I need to build the road. Okay, I call it build the road. Okay, like here, 
is not connected so I can't attack this uh, wasteland it's like you know um, you need to just build the road where it's connected one by one like here to be able to conquer this one okay since that I don't have enough prestige yet and I don't RC I'll just uh, use stamina to to build up my prestige okay I'm gonna attack for wasteland it's just uh, one stamina okay you gain 150 prestige okay still not enough so what we're gonna do is we just continue to build the road help each other to build the road and actually this this event is good for for everyone because um, it's a teamwork it's a nation teamwork that everyone need to participate helping to conquer the land you know like the ancient what all the ancient warlords do they fight and war and try to occupy more and more lands Ace is uh, someone there someone from your nation okay and it's kind of a waste if you if you make a way that is not related not connecting to other fort or altar it's such a waste of your stamina so please uh, try to try not to make this mistake and for this one I uh, it's not unlock yet so you can't really occupy the, the wasteland there okay here we're gonna build the road to the next to the bottom there just to reach to the fort okay here uh, you can see that Phoenix sent you for stamina okay this is because uh, they RC and once they RC everyone get extra four stamina okay not only him alone see two three so you get uh, 12 stamina for free okay this is a base like I said claim the cloud coins okay so that you can buy something from the shop okay now that I have 9530 prestige I can just uh, search for the fort to conquer the fort we have to search for it which one is unoccupied or occupied by the the enemy we're gonna just go and seize it the reason you want to focus on fort because uh, as you can see fort give you 80 nation flag per 10 minute and also 80 uh, cloud coins but if you just uh, use your stamina on wasteland you only gain 5 per 10 minutes okay so that's that's a huge difference and this arrow here is a quick move where you can check all the map okay like where you want to go you want to go to the south or the northeast or the palace zone here the palace here this is the palace I'll show you in a short while okay we go to altar quick move this is the altar you can attack it but truce oh someone attacked the enemy has already occupied it so 
we just have to go and search for search for any place that is yeah about here <coughs> we need to occupy okay now you see all this all this place here is such a waste of your stamina opening all this all you need to do is this make a way make one road okay like this connecting to this four okay like this connecting to the second four and so on okay this is the correct way don't waste your stamina all here okay it's useless it's just a waste okay so if you haven't subscribed yet please do subscribe and hit the like button share my video so that everyone can everyone can learn a bit and your subscription and also your like is very important to me it motivate me to make more video so it is much appreciated okay okay this is the altar okay we already occupied it you need 10,000 prestige to be able to uh, attack and this is where you can dispatch your uh, defense okay I'll just dispatch one and it it will consume uh, stamina if I'm not mistaken you can add defense but my advice is you keep some of your minister for later on tonight when the palace is open as you can see palace is opening in 8 hours and 29 minutes that is when you need your minister to defend the palace okay so what we're gonna do now is we check for any unoccupied altar uh, fort hmm okay Where is it? Oh, everyone is occupied. Mm. Sometimes it takes some time to to find the new fort. Okay, here, there's one enemy. You can either attack the enemy to chase him out, or to attack the base. I'll just attack the fort to conquer it. Okay, this is how I utilize my stamina. Okay. If you don't want any of your um, enemy to conquer here, you can just attack this, clear it out, so that they have no more chance to occupy your base this is one of the strategy to cut off because since that this is not much only six of them six of the tiles so just conquer it then your enemy won't have any chance to retrieve this fort okay unless they have to make a, a long road okay there's one enemy here so we're gonna chase him out attack him okay this is basically um, how you conquer the how you build the road utilize your stamina take advantage okay I don't want to waste so many uh, time searching for the fort I'll just show you the next thing is the shop 
This is all about the healing, which you can heal your minister HP. This by 10%, 30%, 50%. This is the anima grass, which can restore your minister immediately. Okay, this is the buff. This is for attacker only, okay? It will uh, decrease enemy HP by 25%, 200%. And this one is so uh, at 20% chance to increase attack by 10 times. This one, 100% chance to increase attack by 2 times. This is, uh, this can be used on either attacker or defender. When the HP is below 0 or 0, it will restore 30% of HP. This is a shield where the dam damage taken will be decreased by 50%. You can also buy anima grass with gold. And this is the withdrawal token. This is the stamina bag. You can buy 6 of them. Each will give you 4 stamina. Okay, how you gonna use it is that Okay, this is a uh, damage decrease by 50% indestructibility. Okay, as you can see, my Suk Saha Tian Wen Jing, I give them each one. Suk Saha, I give them three. Abilon, I just give him one now. Okay, as for my Minister, I give him one here. Okay, I'll show you. And then, if I go to shop and then I buy this uh, increase by 10 times, I buy 5 of them. And then, I go to the back, I go to the buff. I use this on my Kansi again. As you can see, okay, e indestructibility is back to 3. And if I give to Kansi again, here you can see my unstoppable momentum buff is back to five okay which means you can only give one type of buff to your minister okay you can give him two okay doesn't matter okay you can give each one and then you can give uh nobu maybe just this is just for for showing on this video so uh, I, I, I actually will give them all all the attacking buff okay this is just to show everyone here okay what is the difference that you give two on and you give one to to the other minister okay once they are defeated they will reduce negative one they will deduct one so which means once if my currency is defeated he still have one he still have another buff okay so i no need to uh come back and buy it and and replace it for him okay here you can check the result click on the details you will see who attack you okay to avenge you need token which uh, you need to rc for it okay just go to shop and click advance here okay once you rc all your member will get extra four stamina okay that's how you get uh free stamina from people who rc okay and then this arrow here 32 comma 108 this is a quick map you can go everywhere you want like now I'm here, I want to go north or go north east. I go north east. Okay, then I click on quick move. There, here I am. Okay, so now that I know that I'm at north east, so I'll just check around here. Okay. There's few fort over here that I can conquer. Yeah. 
See the enemy cut off the lane so that we can't attack them unless we build a road here like here we're gonna take over this okay utilize your stamina that's what I'm gonna try to tell you okay and for your information I didn't RC at all and look at my rank I'm still at the uh, rank 24 which is not bad right this is how I utilize my stamina okay so since that no one is doing anything here so I'll just uh, spend two stamina on this and this just to conquer this three fort okay uh, let's do it okay see unstoppable momentum which means uh, you get a random bar from okay defeat it okay there's enemy here we're gonna chase him out we attack the enemy okay there's one more enemy no more okay now we move on to the next fort we conquer it now screen Okay, another one. Okay, we just need one to reach here. What? Oh, they are attacking. So I'm gonna use my bag anima grass to revive okay since that i don't have enough i'll just restore my hp first before they kill it okay now i go shop and then i buy anima grass i'll just buy everything i have a lot of cloud coins so it doesn't matter okay i'm gonna recover because I'm lazy to wait okay now I'm gonna use uh, my stamina to attack this and to attack again there's an enemy I know I can't beat him oh I did I you got the upper hand in battle players can re sequence the minister position in team to get better result okay i managed to win or not oh okay keep attacking wait i need back to restore okay I'll just move on okay since that here is green so we can still attack this one I'm gonna use my stamina back try to occupy it as much as possible okay there's two stem two uh, enemy but there's no point if you if you attack them so it's better you just spend your stamina <coughs> getting the port uh the fort <coughs> you 
you can RC for stamina, you can RC for... Okay, someone is here. Okay, let's take it over. Done. And conquer everyone. Okay, this one. I left one stamina. Hopefully that someone is here to help. Because I need to wait for 11 minutes for my next stamina. So you, you, you can mark it. So that your nation member can know. Battlefield. Too many injured. Use the bag, anima grass, restore them. Okay, this is for the video purpose. Just restore them with anima grass, okay? For healing pill. If there's no minister injured, it won't show any minister here, okay? So you know what's the use of this uh, bath, everything. Okay, I just give it to my minister since I can buy it all this uh, later on. Okay, for this here. You have consumed 284 out of 260 stamina. You can claim. Okay. This uh, is free. Okay. Your team. You can always edit or replace. So go back to the base and collect your claim, claim your cloud coins for shopping. Okay, that's about it. Now I'm gonna show you a little bit uh, footage of uh, the palace, how it looks like when the palace is open. Okay. Let's head to the palace. Okay, here we are. This is uh, footage from uh, day one. When the palace is open. Okay, there's a sign there that the palace is under siege. Okay, this is the palace. You click on it twenty thousand per ten minutes. Okay, just go inside. This is how it looks like. Same thing. Three of your top player and this is a defender. This is the name and the minister that is defending okay you can also add your minister to defend the palace okay now once you dispatch your defense team it will consume one stamina and of course you gain gain some reward and you get the soul shards So I think it's worth it. One stamina for for like potential or the soul shot. I think it's worth it. It needs a uh, five minister per defense team. Okay, and of course you can also use the 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 buff. 
to strengthen your your minister okay on the top uh, left you can see the second that you occupied that your nation has occupied the palace okay this 258 now okay make sure to claim this one once the once the palace timer has gone otherwise it will be gone the next day so make sure you claim it okay this is all the buff okay that's about it courage consume full attack okay like here I buy this uh, defense to put on my uh, defense team that is why I said earlier that you save up some minister waiting to defend your 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 palace okay so that's about it for this uh, Roland video I hope you guys enjoy and learn something about it please uh, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button thank you very much and have a nice day